All right, welcome back, guys, to Cyberpunk 2077. My name is Nick. As always, you guys can call me Tetra Ninja, and we are continuing with. Oh, it's right there. Let's <laughs> get. When do we get new wheels? Because this thing does not bode well for a high-level gangstar. So we are continuing with the main mission. Um, we're doing the optional thing first, which. Probably I don't even consider would be optional. We have to go meet this Militech agent. And then we gotta go talk to our, our boy Jackie. So, we are gonna go around the city and see what the nightlights have to do. Wow, this guy. Okay, that wasn't my fault. He, like, it's never my fault. <laughs> like, just stop going. Why, why would you just stop driving? What is this music, though? Pumping. Oh, straight fish tailing. This thing drives like a boat. Hey, you! Yeah, we got that music bumping in the background. Do, 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 do. So this lady was kind of frosty when we talked to her on the phone. So hopefully she's a little bit nicer in person. Probably not. We were given the uh, option also to uh, betray Dex, which probably short term would have been more money. Long term, I don't think would have been a good idea. I'm actually surprised that the majority of this game is played in first person Look mode. Lively. Meredith Stout. Take it you were the one to call. That'd be me. Wow. Thought you could blackmail me, fucker. Set conditions. Got any more for me? Get your fucking hands off me. Crap! A fucking thing ready? All set. Now answer my questions. Honestly. Forthrightly. Are you here alone? Yep. Just little old me. It's the truth. Do a sweep now. Now listen, boys. This piece of shit, Anthony Gilbert. Is he your contact? Is he the one who leaked intel on the convoy? That guy? Never seen him before. Checks out. Listen, I know where the transport is. I can help you. Just want a favor in return. <sighs> I told you! I fucking told you! I'm not the mole! Jesus Christ! Shut him up! Unhand me now before I... <sighs> Him, you can let go. Want to hear what he has to say? Couldn't have been chill from the start. Shut the fuck up. Tell me what you want. I need a bot. Flathead model. Guys who ripped you off have it. Promise me that bot. I'll point the finger. You have a plan how to deal with them? Could just take it by force, but they're expecting payment. So I could go that route too. Fine, the latter. But on one condition. You pay with our money. <laughs> no. No what, Stout? My offer just came off the table. Mistake. Big mistake. There was something on that. Stop, you bitch! You're done! You're fucking done! You and everyone under your thumb! You hear that, fella? Maybe 
maybe I should have paid with her money. Oh my god. Eh, I can go through this, right? Yeah, go, car! You got it. It's okay, it's okay. Just need a little bit more speed. I can do it. Incoming crash! Oh yeah, baby, that's what I'm talking about. Jackie, my boy. Ah, there you are. Let me hear what you squared away. Been waiting long. My mother always said patience pays off, so... T-Bug show any sign of life? You two talk? She's up to date and fired up to work with Dex. Preparing already. They're familiar, you know? Worked together before Dex took his break. So Dex already paid the Maelstromers for the Corporal bot. Thing is, can't be sure the gang goons are still willing to hand it over. He paid up front? Hijole. Well, whatever. Let's go get this tech. You skin yet? You got a plan? That shit can go smoothly. This is Maelstrom. Gang world ain't too complicated. Might's right, the strong survive. Either you fuck others, or you get fucked. So, into the Borg Beast then? Let's go see these bastards. All right, let's knock on their door. See if they even open up. Oh, it's right here. I hate these Borg fuckers. Just had to be them. It's a gang like any other, right? I think the Valentinos. They follow God and... Santa Madre. Honor means something to them. You know what they want. How they get it, and what pisses them the fuck off. With Maelstrom, you just never know. Go on, let them know we're here. <sighs> Don't know you. Want to talk to Royce? Dex sent us. Random turrets. Uh, cozy place. They could use a few plants, though. Oh, yeah. They look damn well prepared. Hey, boys in there. A Militech truck. Cabron has only swiped a couple crates. Not a whole fucking semi. Don't think I've ever seen security like this in a chow factory. Gear from the Jack Convoy. Gotta be. Must have been all over it like maggots on dead meat. Yeah, this place is armed to the tits. Anti-personnel mine. Directional shrapnel spitter. My favorite. Subtle. Stay cool. They're just trying to spook us. See Royce. We got biz to transact. Mr. Royce is busy just now. Oh, there's the photo mode. You'll deal with me. You got a bot. Model MT0 D12. Called the Flathead. And? The hell you care? Guy I represent already paid brick for it. I'm just here for the pickup. I can talk direct to Royce if necessary. Now. Nah. 
You talk to me. Name's Tum Tum. Now couch. Planet. Trap. Shit. Well, all right. Come on. Got to lighten up. Take a hit. What you blowing? Eskeev. Pure as baby powder. Black lace. Tough to get your hands on. Gotta have a good source. What's it do? Ups dwarfs and adrenaline to the point you feel no pain. Trip so intense it verges on psychosis. Corpse fed it to their fighting legions during the Corp Wars. Cyber psychos pop the tabs like candy. Vaporizing and mellows the burn without killing any of the effect. Come on, give it a whirl! Thanks, I'm good. Whatever you say, straight-edged princess. Here we go. The flathead. Model MT0-D12. Militech's not gonna come looking for it? Fuck them. They can hop around and try. We'll remove the serial number and lift it in access locks using our soft. What's yours, is yours. Need to see it. Sue yourself. Fucking tricked out this thing. Dynamic thermal optic camo armor. Full cognitive immersion with a Raven controller. Pimped out prototype actuators made of titanium vanadium Kevlar composite. And watch this. Fully integrated link too. So when the spider starts crawling up walls dangling from ceilings. Mm -hmm. Could lose your lunch. So what you think? We'll have to do. <laughs> Look at that. Picky little fucker. Let's see your cred. Brick got it. It's all paid up. Brick got it. <laughs> I don't see any fucking brick around here, do you? Come on. Can't expect me to pay for this thing twice. And who the fuck are you to say what can and can't be? You'll pay twice because I say you'll pay twice. Nope. All right. You want the flathead? I better see some eddies. Seems you already got the eddies for it. You want to offer us a discount? A discount? Fuck. You know, you never did say who sent you. Never did say who you're working for. Dexter Deshaun. That's who. Dexter Deshaun. The lord ass who punching animal fucked half a Pacifica? <laughs> he ain't dead? No. He's alive, well, and kicking. And he sends his regards. So you're gonna consider my offer now? You're short, Zerk! Bang. Bring it, cocksuckers! Cut me a rat! Going down! Where's they got him? Waste of all, bitches! Iron sights are terrible, dude. 
I feel like there's something like with that credit shit that lady was giving us. There's something on it. Grab the gear. Uh, you're on Bot fire, dude. Side. Quick! Gotta fight me out of here. Just call me Revolver Ocelot. Said, bot and controller. Let's go. Quicker than that. Thanks. I wonder if I could have kept the ten thousand credits to myself. Production line. Plus, I thought you loved me. Really, no other way. Maintenance hatch. Good man. Days, bruh. Think you're clever, huh? Oh, you betcha, dude. Probably get through this entire game without killing anyone. But we've already murdered a bunch of people now, so I don't really think it matters. This isn't Metal Gear. Kill as many people as I want. Can't hide. You know that. Oh, you bet I can, bro. Charge. What? Figure out what's going on here first. Oh, 
Oh, come on, dude. This guy too. Brick. God, felt like a fucking eternity. That been in here a while? Few days. Kind of lost count. Some guys loyal enough to care slip me stuff, tried to help out. Royce threw him in the microwave dryer. Made me watch. Guess it's kind of your fault we're here. Came for some tech Dex bot. He tell you to free me? No, just to pick up the bot. Classic fucking Dex. <laughs> Looking a little like we might have saved your skin. Think we're doing a favor, hombre. Jesus, slow down, maybe. I'll catch you, but kind of caught me at a bad time. We ever meet again, I'll have you covered. Can't hide, you know that. Are you still going on? Probably could use a weapon. Out, use my perks once I get out of Can't this place. Hide. Wow, there's really nowhere to go right now. They're watching all the exits. You're here! I know you are! 
Obviously. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. How do you not see me? Can I take that elevator up? Oh my god. Fuck off. That's so stupid. The head. You're doing so well, too. Kill them all. Move. Super overheating guns. So much for the stealth game. Why am I just catching on fire randomly? Stop looking at me. Rambo! No. Hi. That's what we call a kill shot. Jesus, dude. Guess that's all of them. Literally cameras everywhere. <laughs> Fucking bombs. New area, new stealth opportunities. Blast my way out. Tried to keep the stealth up as long as I could. Didn't pan out. That was kind of bullshit how I got caught. Not gonna lie. I'm coming, Jackie. I'm coming, dude.
never see me again, didn't you? Naive little punk. <laughs> so what now? Maybe I should look into exactly what you did here. Today was about Royce getting his just desserts. Couldn't have done it without you. Flathead's yours. And consider us even. I want a perimeter. Secure the area. How are we even? Time we were on our way, Kanan. Holy shit, V. I wasn't sure we'd walk out in one piece. Thanks, Jack. Solid as ever. Hey, yeah, you too, but, uh, hey, what's this about? You feeling all right? Yeah, I want to make sure, you know? We're good together. I like how we do things. I do too, V. I do too. Hey, let Dex know we got his toy for him. And then I say we hit the afterlife. <laughs> you know, do some shots. Hay luego, V. How things looking, Mr. V? Got the bot. And how'd it go? Run into any trouble? And what about the Militech angle? Sure, of course it was trouble. Boys couldn't have given two shits you and Brick had shaken on. How'd you get him on board? You used the Corpo one? I met Stout. And? Didn't exactly hit it off. Poor Mary. No doubt in my mind she'll be left picking up the tab after your bad day. So how'd you get that cat Royce to hand over the flathead? Only way I know that always works. Brute force. You got some balls, Mr. V. We're all set. Ready to go. What now? Now we do the job I hired you to do. Grabbing that biochip. We'll talk about the rest at the afterlife. See you there. Great. Be there in no time. See you, Mr. V. Oh my god. You serious? <laughs> That's... Check out my character skills. Level 20. <sighs> Give me those knives, dude. Just call me an assassin in training. Extra health is always good. Oh, what the hell? Yo, brakes failing. Come on, guys. Bro. 
routine inspection has shown many have been corrupted with malware. Police experts... Afterlife. No, porque ya tengo planes para esta noche. Virgen Santísima Ma, te vas a enterar mañana. Yo también te quiero. He loves his baba. Yeah, about time, Holmes. Looked like you just ran a marathon. Something happened? Years of merc work, and yet still sweat like a roasted pig when I talk to my ma. Can't help yourself, you know. Checking to see if I'm not rotting in some dumpster, like most of the Wells boys. It's really starting to wear on me. The more I tell her everything's okay, the more I feel like I'm straight up lying. But that's done after tomorrow. After life, here we come, baby. <laughs> yeah! We have arrived. The Major Leagues. Does not get any higher, chum. And you know something else? We fucking earned it, mano. Ready to get your cherry popped? Yeah, come on! What? This place used to be a morgue. You believe that? Really, Jackie? What? I told you that myself. Oh, for Is reals? Ah, oh, shit. That must have been ages ago. And who am I, you clown? Name's V. This is Jackie Wells. Oh. Is that supposed to sound familiar? It will soon. We're here to see Dex. Yo, Dex. Got two live ones saying they're here to see you. Yeah? All right, then. Says he needs a second or two. Go get yourselves drinks or something. Way ahead of you, viejo. This is it. Drinks. That's where I'm a Viking. You're the Night City. That's it right there. Beating. Hear it? Can you imagine? Susan Forrest, Boa Boa. Maybe even Morgan Blackhand. All set on those stools. Looks like we're up. Hey, you see that old lady there? That's Rogue. Best fixer in all of Night City. Thought Dex was the best. <laughs> Rogue was lining up jobs when Dex was still shitting in diapers. <laughs> Place belongs to her. What can I get you? You order. Two tequila old fashions with a splash of cerveza and a chili garnish. Duo of Johnny Silverhands coming up. Right on, Chica. Somebody did their homework. Looks like the dog ate mine. Age old tradition. Drinks are named after our regulars. How long's the afterlife been around? Half a century? Longer. Don't know by how much, though. That'd be the oldest club in Night City. And the most respected. Don't forget that, Ben. Say I wanted a drink named after me. What would I have to do? Snuff it. Mind-blowingly spectacular fashion. Mid up would be best. Ah, what a beautiful tradition. To Night City. And the afterlife. <laughs> Salud. Who else can I drink here? All on the menu. Except there's a spot missing. Morgan Blackhand, right? <laughs> it's true. Morgan's yet to make up his mind if he's dead or still kicking. <laughs> Nobody knows what happened to him. Think he's still alive? It's been years. Why not? Look at Rogue. Peaked from that era, a species unto themselves. 
Because dying's a small price to pay for going down in history. I live like a legend first, though, huh? Death. It's nothing but the final flourish. Oh, and by the way, name's Jackie Wells. You want to write down my recipe? Hmm, sure. Shot of vodka on the rocks, lime juice, ginger beer. Oh, and most importantly, a splash of love. Ha <laughs> ha! I remember that. Heard you were Dex's latest finds. Just biz, no big deal. Mr. Tishon, Dex a regular? You, you come here a lot? A sort of long hiatus, matter of fact. Didn't show his face for nearly two years. The Tomcat's gotta walk his own path, right? Yeah, well, wherever he walked, he knocked a few pounds off. Guess they weren't delivering that pizza I mentioned before. How do you know? My job to know. Look around. How do you think Mercs earn their reps? Through gossip rivaling that of schoolgirls, that's how. Break a leg. Thanks. This way. It's like a lady in a test tube. Damn, Holmes. Huge. Work out. Same here. No, in the ring. You do some kind of exotic shit? Huh? Kempo? Ninjutsu? Mm. Think you could take me? Drop me? In here. It's dead pinche tipo. That's right. Excelsior. Cold hard eddies, as per usual. Gotta bounce. Well, if it ain't Mr. V. Whole family in one place. Ha! Finally! First time in real space. And the flathead? Let's see this bad boy. All right, then. Set your butts down comfy. Thanks for your help back at the scav haunt. A few Reapers less in the city. Good thing. <laughs> city Hall should be fucking thanking us. Sweet booth. Is soundproof? Jackie. Now, now. Mr. Wells is right. We're gonna be going over some sensitive material. But if it's all right with y'all, I'd like to start with a question for Mr. V. Evelyn Parker, how'd you fare? Well, as I could have, I guess. Walked around Compeki Plaza inside from that raw BD she scrolled. Mm-hmm. Bug already filled me in. So you know the target? Yorinobu Arisaka, the Emperor's son and heir apparent. Mm-hmm. Man with the millionaire name and no talent to back it up. Evelyn Parker's special friend? So she just want to see what's good, or was there something else? Parker chick? I don't know. Sent out mixed signals, so I got mixed feelings. One night, sipping champ paradise with the Orinobu. Next night, chatting it up with regulars at Lizzie's. Worlds don't match up. Struck me, too. You saying we putting two and two together and getting five? Some part of the equation's missing, then. Clearly. That's why y'all gotta fix her. Anyone try to fuck you? They first gotta fuck their way through Dex to Sean's 300-pound ass. Anything else? There was something else. Parker made me another offer. Another offer? Mm-hmm. Kind where we ditched the middleman and split the pot in even 50-50. What? <clears throat> Ditch the middleman? <laughs> Shit, now that's real. Snitching. <laughs> Clients never learn, do they? I do appreciate you sharing this info, though, Mr. V. You see, trust is essential in any partnership that's to be long lasting and fruitful. Appreciation don't convert to eddies. And Evelyn offered us a bunch. 
least telling it like it is, Dex. Y'all need not worry, truly. We'll come to that. Thought you'd be pissed that you'd lose it. I lived in NC too long to blow my top every time some amateur thinks they can take me for a ride. Parker ain't the first, and sure as hell won't be the last. How about we go over the plan? What you got for us, Dex? This. Well, here goes nothing. Me and Dex have already covered the fine deep. Ops-wise, should be a stroll on the beach. Elaborate. I want to hear it. A Delamain will drop your asses at the front door of Kanpeki Plaza. You'll stroll right in thanks to your false identities. Then, with Bug's help, you'll breach the hotel subnet. Mine and the Flathead's help. Last but not least, you slip into Yorinobu's penthouse and clep the relic. Goes without saying, we do this on the hush. Ideally, no bodies. Not a one. You'll have T-Bug on comms for the duration. Time for your burning questions. Transports at Delamain. Primus Cab Company in All Night City. Not a mod. Deshaun don't ever work with anyone but the best. I consider Delamain just that. Yeah, who needs creepy, nosy cab drivers when you've got a clean AI to get you from point A to B in style? And how he bags a permit to operate every year is still a mystery. If everything goes as planned, Delamain will drop you back here. If things get sticky, you head for the safe house. Which is? The no-tell motel. Quiet, no questions asked. Make our next move from there. But I'm flat certain that won't be necessary. Anything else? These new identities. Tell us more. What's our cover? Hello, Ramon Victorino. And you're Harry Conwell. Ramon? Yeah, okay. What do we say we're there for? Biz as usual. Corpo arms deal. In case anyone asks, you there for a bogus meeting with our Osaka's defense rep, Hajime Taki. Anything else? How do we get in the penthouse? Yarnobu's got barely any muscle. Hardest part will be penthouse security. If we want to disable, we'll need to neutralize Kanpeki's dweller, elite runner monitoring the hotel subnet 24-7. Only catch is there's no way to get in the dweller's den from the outside. Hold on. How you want us to get inside a room you can't get into? Trust me when I say whatever hit you think of, T-Bug solved it already. This is where the flathead comes in. You'll have to get him in the ventilation shaft, guide him to the dweller, and force the dweller to take a break. Flathead will stay there, jacked into the dweller. But thanks to that, I'll be able to roll out your red carpet into the penthouse. Anything else? Okay, feel brought up to speed. Perfect. I got a question. When do we get to the real reason we're all here? Now's a good time as any. Fresh talent gets 30% always. But I'm willing to make an exception in your case. I'm gonna cut you a nice juicy 40 as a bonus for your honesty, P. Appreciate it, Dex. Even though the Eddies aren't most important to me. Interesting. So what does qualify as most important? Want what everyone worth a damn wants. To be remembered. People, after hours, place like this. 50 years on, talking about what I pulled off. You want to build cred, your rep, with you a hundred on that. Last thing, kompeki has got a strict no-iron policy, security gates, the works. So you dogs will leave your lead spitters in the ride, take the flathead inside in its case. Got some deft suits, so you'll look the part, too. Gee, oh. Thanks, T. So, not to count chickens, but why don't we see our eddies? All depends how Miss Parker avails herself of her role, but a week, two tops is my guess. And what do we do while we sit around, suck air? You sit tight, heads down, cause old Uncle Arasaka be watching. Now as that old Greek dog says, life's a banquet, so don't go thirsty, but don't get drunk either. Your chariot awaits outside. My cue to Delta Two. Got a prep to jack in. Be there when you come on comms. Any other issues, 
Now's your chance. Plan. What's your take? Enough, I hope, to put me in a luxury Cretan villa from which I'll never set foot in cyberspace again. Promise to send me a postcard? No offense, but I'm gonna burn any and all bridges. Need a clean break. You and Dex know each other a while. Um, why? Uh, you know, people say all kinds of things. Everything we hear is an opinion, not a fact. Marcus Aurelius, I think. <laughs> you and Dex both philosophize in it. No wonder you get along. I'm good, no questions. Let's get to work. So you ready to get going or what? Something I gotta take care of first. Sin problemas. Meet you by the Delamain. Suit up! Fancy! Just don't forget to suit up. My Delamain is waiting. We got a drink before we leave? Are such a piece of crap <laughs> all right ladies and gentlemen that's gonna be it for this part two of the series things are slowly picking up got a little bit of a fight scene get a little bit more of the story and we will continue on part three in the next episode so if you enjoyed as always thumbs up are greatly appreciated and we will see you guys next time as always have a fantastic day